Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. It's kind of a bittersweet day today because we had to say goodbye to the Rainmakers. However, as a consolation prize, we got Speed Serum back and as you know, Speed Serum probably one of the better temporary GBE abilities you can get. Makes everything more fun, including my Skormadir. So before we hop into our first battle, let's get our code Cosmic plugged in quick. Make sure you guys get that plugged in for the week. Uh, helps us out tons and we really appreciate it. Anyway, let's move on to the attacks and I haven't been getting many bases the past couple days. It's like I get like two days out of the week after I clear my map, I get a good amount and then the like other couple days, it just, it doesn't spawn at all. Like, I'm not quite sure what's going on. Maybe, maybe people are just uh, only playing on weekends. I don't, uh, no idea, but anyway, this first battle, let's start and use a speed serum. I have a bad habit of just Forgetting about the temporary GBE ability and uh, just letting it run. And we got a grappler to worry about, so we're going to get that shocked. I know I could just smoke the Scorchers, but we don't want all them pulled. Uh, but we'll probably only need that one shock to get through it. And now we got a good amount of GBE. I'm going to put two Speed Serums down, one on the Bombardiers and Scorchers. The thing about my Scormadier strat here is uh, the Scorchers and Bombardiers are so far spread out. Um, it's going to be difficult to get all of like the troops hit with one spirit serum but that's all right because we have a hundred over a hundred gbe we are not spending it at all but i'm glad we're able to get through that first base with only a couple casualties in fact i think it was only one scorcher because we don't have that much gold or any loot whatsoever because i converted it and uh boosted up barrage damage got to remember that i boost up barrage damage Critter spawns, uh, Scorcher damage, and Tank Life Leech there. The Tribe Challenge this week, going to be one of the better ones. I can't wait for that. Um, but now, let's move on to the next base. It should be a pretty simple attack. Let's get our Scorchers down and our Bombardiers. And we'll just pop a Speed Serum right away. Get those Scorchers hyped up so they can destroy the defenses that are damage amplified. And essentially... There's all the defenses in front. We're just going to spawn a bunch of critters as distractions and flare onto the HQ. I already did, and this base is going to be free. However, our medics decided to run and die, so we lost a few of them. Rest in peace, medics, but you didn't die in the first attack like you usually do, so you made up for it there. Good for you. Um, good amount of gold, not a good amount of the other loot. I still have my 45%. Resource reward. Ooh, what do we want here? I could use all three of these. I'm gonna go with the dark shards because I'm I've been converting uh, Trying to get a higher GBE Guardian so we need that uh, definitely going for the, the 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 Dark shards there. Let's get our troops down on this one. This will be our first difficult base It's kind of a good layout to take out my scorchers and it also has a grappler So we're gonna have to focus on that but now that we have that de dealt with, we're going to get a couple speed serums out. And essentially, this base is already done. Speed serum, like, Boom Beach has been going on, like, an offensive, overpowered offensive streak right here with the uh, Rainmakers into the, um, now I can't think, the speed serum. My goodness. Uh, but that's okay. We'll take it. It makes attacks much more fun. Even if our base gets attacked a couple times, what do we need that metal for? I've only been on this push to a thousand for months now, which, oh my gosh, at the rate I'm spawning bases, it's gonna be forever before I can get there, but I think we got enough stacked up for a decent slate of attacks for today. And there we go. We're finally getting the loot, and we will retrain our troops, but I don't know. I don't see our gold going up that much. And especially when we attack bases like this. Now I'm going to get a bit picky with loot if we can. Um, okay, that was worth it. Good choice, however. Let's just make sure we keep some Scorchers alive this battle. We're going to throw a box of Critters to coat the landing. What I like to say. I don't know if that makes sense. But it kind of distracts some defenses right away. And then as the Grappler was probably going to identify and destroy a Scorcher, we decided to throw a shock bomb on it however we have lost our bombardiers i think i let a rocket launcher go rogue there on my bombardiers i'm not quite sure unless i accidentally barraged them or something that was that was tragic we are down to three bombardiers i'm still not quite sure what happened so i guess uh uh i don't even see ice statues here is there any ice statues in this base is he hiding any 
<laughs> I'm gonna say no because that looks like a good chunk right there. There's just unfortunate. How many we lost there? Six bombardiers? Wow. That's okay. We'll retrain. Going up in gold a little bit. Moving on to the next base, and we are gonna find a different opponent there. That is insultingly low loot, even though the gold, eh, it was all right. All right, yeah, about the same amount of gold, but more of the other resources. That is what we want to see. And now we are gonna get our troops down. Grappler probably gonna take a scorcher. That is fine. That's like a one big critter right there. And I didn't shock the grappler. Let's get the grappler shocked now. I want, I want like one or two in front of the other one so we can just soak up the damage and uh the other ones don't have to worry about anything mainly like the shock launcher shocks and all that but um yeah we don't want all of our scorchers getting pulled there now we'll throw a flare into the hq and this base is as good as dead down it goes to level 65 so a nice change of pace compared to the last attack where we just destroyed all of our troops uh, but let's see, what was it? What was the loot? Like 150,000 of each, and then plus our research board. All right, all right, not great, not great. But we didn't have any casualties, which is good on the gold front. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, I need another mega crab here. There is just no loot. A level 73, first time attacking a level 73, I think. Maybe I did. I think this is the first time. That is, I'm gonna. I, Wow, this person pushed up. They, they're they getting the upgrades way quicker than I am. That stinks. Oh, I can tell. They're probably, they're probably pretty good at that because they have a lot of the legendary trophies when it comes to the Mega Crab. So he's got he, he, high accolades. We're gonna, we're gonna destroy you, unfortunately, the uh, figures. He doesn't have any ice statues. All offense. That's where you get all those statues from. Just kidding. I, if I had all, all offense, I, probably, I I definitely wouldn't be able to get that. Anyway, congrats to you, but I'm going to take the loot you still have remaining, and I will get to wear the pride of being able to take out a level 73 for the first time. That is awesome. Let's get a flare onto the HQ, and we should be good. Let's just throw a couple more speed serums. Oh man, I wish I was at a thousand, because then I could use Warriors with Speed Serum. If I want to do that, I'm going to have to do it against like Dr. T or Imitation Game or something. Why can't I just be at a thousand already? Like the push to like 1950 area was so smooth, so nice. And then once I got to 19, like 50, there was, I don't know if Boom Beach just died, or there was just a, a switch that was flipped and all of a sudden wasn't spawning bases. And my base was getting attacked constantly. And now I'm just like treading water, which is not fun. I, 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 I just keep flexing between like 970 and 950, which that feeling feels like I'm drowning or about to. Um, but we're going to push past eventually. Let's get a speed serum out. Even if it takes me till next summer when people actually play Boom Beach or next spring. I think it kind of picks up in the winter time. If it, I, I've been playing for... Uh, a few years now and it seems like the fall fall to about like December time boom beach is just on a steady decline and then and then it, it, it kind of stables out and then starts growing again but that's just kind of the cycle of games I guess but we're able to take out this one I didn't see the loot payout but I don't think I have many more bases to attack so let's go ahead and finish it up all right not great on the loot front either we're never gonna get an upgrade we are never going to get an upgrade. Another upgrade that's not a residence, at least. All right. Let's see what our final base has to offer. It's a free base, but it's no loot. I'm just going to take the freebie here. I got to just take the freebie. All right. Let's get our troops down, flare into the HQ, and we'll get a shock out because I feel like I somehow would have lost troops there. Never know. The medic still might wander in. Very quick attack, so efficiency-wise, probably my best attack of the day when it comes to loot per time on attack, but also, we didn't get that much. However, the crystal payout, you love to see that, um, but since I've been getting attacked so much, we're at 964, I'm going to boost up my ice statues here for a couple days, we'll get it at 216. I've been spending so much power powder, I still have over 900, which is good. But I don't know. I like being over a thousand. We'll get it up to two days and 15 hours like the other one. 
And then I have a prototype in the lab here, a damage amplifier. Where would be a good place to put this? Kind of like right here area. Oh, why is that rocket launcher not in range? That is thoroughly disappointing. How that rocket launcher is just one away. Literally one away. Do I, do I dare? We'll get the flamethrower out of it. Actually, I feel like, I feel like I should do a switch here. We don't need the machine gun damage amplified. Flamethrower would be much more beneficial in my opinion, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna jimmy my base around a bit uh, to get more defenses in it or more effectively, but that's gonna be it. Thanks for watching. Speed Serum, enjoy it. After this, it'll probably be a dead time in Boom Beach when it comes to like uh, the proto troops and special abilities, but that's okay. Then we just we we just have to push through to Mega Crab, which is always fun. But that's it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.